two weeks ago, the commissioner made certain comments on national TV. Uh, one, that he does not watch the news. He's not uh, engaged in what is taking place, even though this is an issue of national importance. And more importantly, what he disclosed to the nation was that he did not know where the file was. I think that was a really unfortunate and really reckless statement by him, the Commissioner of Police, to make such a, such a statement. And so what has happened since then is that he has now sent a follow-up letter uh, dated the 20th of May, in which he now ac acknowledges, one, that he has the file, and two, like the Auditor General before him and like the Ombudsman before him, he too will not be turning over that investigative file to COLA. Now, just as a reminder, on May the 7th, the Director of Public Prosecutions wrote to COLA, wrote to myself, and said very clearly that she has no problem whatsoever in us getting access to the file. What I interpret that to mean is that the DPP does not intend to follow through with a public prosecution. The fact that she's saying, go ahead, you can have access to the file, you can continue with your pro prosecution. So the statement now by the commissioner that the evidence may lead to a public prosecution, I find to be totally incongruous with what the DPP herself is saying. So the commissioner, instead of giving in to her request, the DPP's request to turn over the file to facilitate us, he's now saying, no, 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 there might be a public prosecution. But coming from the DPP, she's saying, turn over the file to COLA. So there are two conflicting uh, statements there, one coming from the DPP and one coming from the commissioner. It is clear to my mind that the commissioner was looking for an out. He was looking for another excuse because he cannot carry on with this uh, nonchalance. He can, cannot carry, carry on and say that the file has disappeared into thin air. So now what he is doing, he's actually saying that um, I cannot give you the file because there might be a public prosecution and it may prejudice the trial of Mr. Penner. Now what, what is greater prejudice than not giving us the file? So come Thursday there might not